No doubt you've heard the phrase countless times. Work hard in school so that you can secure a good job, which will lead to a comfortable life. And although there are other alternatives to make a living, getting a job is still the best and most preferred means to do so. Nevertheless, some people on this same earth are making an admirable income doing very strange jobs. That's why in today's video, we'll be looking at the 12 most unorthodox jobs which surprisingly pay decently well. 12. Professional Mourners Professional mourner jobs are indigenous to culture-rich societies such as the Chinese and in the Middle East, where bereaved families hire professional mourners to help them grieve a lost loved one who had few friends. The mourners are supposed to learn as much as they can about the deceased, his family, and also his way of life. They visit the family beforehand to gather the information. They cry and console the members of the family during the whole funeral service. They also engage in social conversations, with other mourners present, friends, and family. For this simple job, they get paid $45 for a day's worth of work. 11. Embalmer You've probably heard this name before on our channel, but did you know this odd job could make you a fortune? Experienced embalmers can go home with a whopping $30,000 a year. There isn't any formal education required here, but most funeral homes require you to go through some training which is improved by the country's Institute of Embalmers members. It's a tough industry to break into, so make sure to sell yourself before venturing into this career path, after which you get to prepare dead bodies for funerals. This job turns out to be very difficult for the faint-hearted because you'll be stitching up these bodies and spending a lot of time with them beforehand. Additionally, you also apply their makeup and disguise any physical damages on the face and body. Sometimes you're even required to drain out the victim's blood and fill them up with embalming fluid. Embalmers are known for their sensitive nature and are mostly calm, which enables them to handle such a grave moment with dignity and patience. So if this describes your personality, how about you hold on to this career path? You'll end up with a fat income every end of the year. 10. Portable Toilet Delivery Drivers This is the furthest from glamour you can go when it comes to like our jobs. Nonetheless, this is one of the most highly demanded services when it comes to events, parties, rallies, and other functions. You wouldn't believe how many calls in one day you'll be getting to deliver toilets around your area. The biggest task is being able to deliver the toilets, set them up, and collect them at the end of the specified period. Also, you clean and service them to maintain how well they look. In addition to that, you'll need a driving license and a very skilled driver, or else you'll end up with a very messy truck, probably a lot of trouble with the county officers. Your drivers and team will get to enjoy flexible hours and the opportunity to travel to unique destinations. For such a disgusting job, enjoying free road trips doesn't sound like a bad thing after all. Also, the $20,000 yearly salary can sure make any stomach settle. 9. Live Mannequin A live mannequin's job description is exactly as you interpret those words. Real-life people stand around in shops dressed in the items that are on sale. While they mimic the postures of normal mannequins that you and I are accustomed to, most designers use them to dress and fit apparel on them. This gives them a more clear picture of the design. They can make adjustments on the fit and how the dresses drape on a model and make it look stunning. You'll spend a good amount of time up on your feet, but it seems worthwhile as you get a $50,000 check yearly. Considering that the only requirement is that you have a well-built body or killer curves for the ladies, this job is one to look out for. 8. Dog Food Taster Well, one of the weirdest jobs to ever exist is a dog food tester. Yes, a human being has to make sure that dog food and treats are up to standard. The job includes a pleasant taste for your furry friend and is nutritious enough for their diet. You'll need to have a degree to get into this industry because who told you your only job was to wolf down pet food? You'll spend your days evaluating pet food nutritional value, writing reports, and even suggesting new enhancements for the food. When it all comes down to it, you'll have to use your mouth to do some food sampling. An enticing salary of about $54,000 per year is waiting for you. Often, many don't swallow the pet food but instead spit it out after getting the taste and feel. Why use humans instead of dogs and cats? Maybe because the pets can't express themselves in words? The science behind it is that if a human doesn't like the taste, smell, or texture of the food, most likely the pets won't also like it. Additionally, which pet owner wants a house full of fish-smelling pet food even if your dogs or cats love it? 7. Rent-A-Friend If you ever find yourself in need of some quick cash, you could register onto a Rent-A-Friend app where you can get to meet new people and have a good time while at it. The client will cater to all entertainment needs, ranging from food to drinks. Guess it's a lonely world nowadays that we need to hire people to be friends with us. 
Or is it that people are terrified of the people around them that they'd rather hang out with total strangers? Which do you think it is? 6. Snuggling Buddy Because the world is full of total weirdos who fancy strange things, someone decided to make good out of this and created a company that offers people snuggling buddies. You get a buddy to snuggle with you all through the night till you fall asleep, but that's if you can afford to pay for it. Or instead, you get 90 minutes with a total stranger snuggled up with you in bed. I don't know why someone would pay for a stranger to hop into bed with you for whatever reason. But what do I know? Because people seem to love it and pay well for this. This leaves such employees earning up to $40,000 every year, all from spooning, cuddling, and hugging with a total stranger for a night. As weird as it sounds, the perks of these jobs are looking good. Offering flexible working hours, picking who to serve and who not to, and that fat paycheck at the end of your shift. Also, you don't need any form of education or experience to get hired. I do, however, hope that they do criminal background checks for their employees. 5. Bed Warmer In the cold winter season, amid the festival celebrations of Christmas, many motels opt to hire bed warmers. They say it brings in more customers. The people who book into these motels love to tuck into an already warm bed. I wonder if they know that a person slept on their sheets before their arrival. Maybe they think some cool gadgets are used by hotel management to give off this warmth in the beds. It's even more strange that this idea is supported by scientists who claim that people fall asleep faster in beds in an already warm bed. Would you accept this complimentary service for your Holiday Inn? Let us know in the comments. Or Furniture Tester It must be nice for those who've been able to secure a spot for themselves in this job. Most of the time, this job title is divided into two categories, the Comfort Testers and the Safety Testers with comfort testers having it way easier than safety testers. They get to sit around all day on sofas, comfortable chairs, and other pieces of furniture. Can you imagine they even get to lay on beds during working hours with no one questioning them? They don't require a diploma or degree for them to get hired. Not even prior experience is needed. The only thing you need to have is the will and the time to do the job. Safety testers, however, require at least a degree in engineering to get hired. Safety technicians usually carry out laboratory experiments to test the safety of furniture. Plus, it's usually a full-time job, so be sure to pick wisely what you want to do for a living. 3. Golf Ball Diver Golf ball retrieval and recycling have become a multi-million dollar industry, and it's still growing. This is due to the man-made ponds created on the golf courses, which are used for irrigation purposes, or as an enticement for angel players, who in turn end up playing a round or two. Unfortunately, these features, meant to entice, also end up drowning players' golf balls in the middle of games. Following this, Many divers get hired to retrieve these balls from pond floors and resell them for profit. They also get paid well for these services. Unlike the other odd jobs, this one requires training and mastery of diving skills, coupled with other skills and requirements. Requirements range from 1. Being a certified diver who's undergone professional diving training and testing, first aid classes, and diving rescue classes. 2. You need to be employed by a legitimate golf retrieval company or have a signed contract between you and a golf course before attempting any dive. 3. You or the company you work for have to pay a small fee to the golf course for the balls retrieved. This job requires bravery, as it's quite a task digging into the dark, dirty, hazardous golf ponds. You could get cut by broken glass, or even bitten by a venomous snake that's lurking in these murky waters. You get paid about $50,000 and $100,000 every year to crawl into these zero-visibility golf ponds. 2. Paper Towel Sniffer have you ever wondered how paper towels just seem to all have the same smell? It just smells of nothing except for those that are laced with essential oil. There are people who get paid to ensure this standard of smell is at its best after each production. Firms go to the extent of listing this strange job post on their sites whenever they need professional help. They don't require any formal academic background, but you get paid more if you've been in this industry longer. Moreover, you need to have a great sense of smell and some basic social interaction skills because no one ever wants to walk with a mean, difficult-to-deal-with person. After a day of smelling the towels, you go home with a salary of up to $52,000 annually. 1. Sewer Flusher If your greatest passion is serving others while doing a job that impacts people's lives, then maybe this is for you. Sewer flushers are usually tasked with ensuring sewage systems are operating well. How, you may wonder? They dive into manholes and clear any blockages that are stopping the free flow of sewages. You'll need to have a really strong stomach to withstand the sight, smell, and feel of all the filth all over your body. Additionally, you mustn't suffer from claustrophobia or else you're not fit for the job because you'll be crawling through some tight spaces while on duty. 
For now, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.